Good afternoon and salam ibu petiriku. A boat suspected of being from North Korea with several bodies was found on a small island in northern Japan. According to the Japanese Coast Guard on Sunday, the wrecked boat that had the decomposing bodies on board was found on Sado Island in Niigata Prefecture on Friday. Japanese media reports said an investigation had started on whether the boat was from North Korea, as Korean language items were found on the boat. At least 50 people have died in Bangladesh as cold weather continues to sweep across the country. According to weather officials, the country's lowest temperature this year was recorded at 4.5 degrees Celsius early on Sunday in Tetulia, a border town in north of Bangladesh. The weather office said the cold snap accompanied by chilly winds and dense fog was likely to continue for a few more days. Thousands of tourists risk being stranded in Australia's southeast Monday as a new heat wave left firefighters across the country, bracing for another round of potentially catastrophic bushfire. More than 30,000 people were told to evacuate Victoria State's popular East Gippsland region Sunday amid fears as soaring temperatures and gusting winds would stoke three large blazes, cutting off the last major road still open. Conditions are also expected to deteriorate over the next two days in the worst heat New South Wales, where 100 fires were burning Monday morning. Well, that is all for me. I'm Yumei Sunifo, TV Sarawak. Anytime, anywhere.